Hi all, so today we will be learning about selecting element based on layout in Playwright with Python series. So uh, you can see like Playwright can select elements based on the page layout. This can be combined with regular CSS for better results. So for example they have given like input colon write off and this, so this is we need to remember right write off input is the tag and write off or left off above below near so these are the things which we need to use so this is basically I, I, I will give you example okay so uh, let's go to my incognito mode so yeah so here uh, I have opened this Gmail sign in page and uh, here you can see like uh, let's say we need to identify this element okay to continue to Gmail maybe we do not want to know the text okay just want to fetch this value and uh, what is the best way to do like if you get the locator of sign in and you can mention like below sign in or not the locator but if you can give the text and below this text uh, we should be we should have this uh, locator right so like this uh, so it is like relative one so it is kindly this text is below sign in similar way like this one is in the right part of this create account text or this button right this next button is present right of this create account or we can say like this create account button is present left of this next button okay so we can uh, this this thing we can uh, locate using this locator okay so let's go back to the page and let's just copy this one okay and okay before copying what I can do let me open the PyCharm and uh, let me just use this playwright code gen and use www or maybe I can just get it from here gmail login and copy link address and just paste it so it will open gmail.com and okay so we got this gmail.com open right now what we have to do like we need to uh, fetch I mean we need to check whether this locator is working correctly so which locator so that will be constructing so just click on inspect and go to this console tab and here as we know like playwright dot dollar we have to enter first and then um, then we just go here and take this one okay and let's modify it so we know like this is not input tag right so this is actually a span tag you can see here span right so I'll just change it to the span and we do not have to use write off because this continue to Gmail this text is present below sign in so we'll use below and here text that is fine we will be using text but instead of password we'll be using sign in and let's hit enter and let's check once more time one more time like uh, this should be in the single quote as we know like if there is I mean this will not work so you have to give it in single quote and outside I mean the whole part should be in the double quote hit enter so you can see this it is correctly identifying this continue to Gmail so in this way we can identify this locator and we can extract this text and validate it if required right so okay and another another one we can try like this write off one so just go here and instead of span we can change it to the button why button because if I hover over it I can see this is a button type this is a button I mean tag is button so button colon below not below it should be right off so right off and here this is also a button so button right off uh, so that's fine um, whether it's a button or not we don't not, we do not need to know that so button colon right off uh, colon text so we'll be using here instead of sign in uh, create account
hit enter so yep so it's locating correctly this next button right yeah so this is uh, second way or third way <laughs> i don't know exactly but uh, yeah there are several way to locate element uh, so this is uh, one of those ways right so whichever you think will be helpful for you in your project or whenever it is required appropriate i mean not required but if it is appropriate then use it okay so you can try other one as well so instead of from this next one you can just use the left off that is also possible let's try that as well so instead of right off we can say left off and text instead of text we can use next okay so this is also working and there is one more i think there that is it's, it's right off left off above below so above below also we can do it with this one okay so with this to continue gmail we can use the above one so we can get the sign in locator so whatever required and here is like uh, if it is not exactly above or below okay in that case you can use it so yeah i hope it is helpful and let me know if you have any doubts thank you for watching